Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Dogcraft. My name is Stacy and I am joined as always by the Minecraft versions of my real life dogs, Paige and Molly. And it seems really empty in my home now uh, that Stampy and Milk Toast are no longer here. They're over in the new Tomcat Towers with Dog the Cat and it's a, it's a little sad. I haven't, uh, I filled in the cat cubby and now I have this little room here that I'm not really quite sure what to do with. It's got an awesome view. Uh, but anyway, that is for another episode. Uh, we are going to go ahead, actually, and, of course, uh, grab our carob chip cookies and head up to the Dalmatian Plantation, where every episode I add one more Dalmatian. Uh, it's definitely not lonely up here. There's quite a few of you guys. I'm going to have to do something with you. Uh, as soon as I reach 101, I think that's what I've decided. As soon as I reach 101, then we will have to do something uh, with this Dalmatian plantation because it will just be overrun with Dalmatians. So let's go ahead and give one to Perdita with the light blue collar. And if I can find Pongo, I thought I saw him over here. Oh, here he is in the corner with the red collar. There we go. And today we are adding little puppy Angelina. And that is because Angelina put her own spin on Dogcraft in her world. She built me a birch castle with the blue and white striped floors, all the doggies, the carob chip cookie factory, Basil's Barkery, Honey Moo Moo's home, uh, Not Pillow and Damien's bed, the escape artist pigs, and then this was my favorite, the where the cats would sleep but there's no cats in pocket edition. So good job. I heard her being born, but I didn't actually see. There's Perdita. Puppy? Well, oh, there, there you are. Hi, Angelina. Welcome to the Dalmatian Plantation. Uh, okay, so I'm going to go ahead now and head downstairs. Uh, I'm going to first check out the artwork, like I do also in almost every episode, in my little art gallery. So, in the last episode, I put the finishing touches on the Tomcat Towers. Uh, here's a picture of Stampy surrounded by cake. Uh, this is uh, a combination of all the things that happened in the episode. When the baby zombie came at me, uh, I loved the style of this. I really liked it. Uh, and then this one is amazing this is all of the animals like the wolves uh, including the fox and like there's a little attribute for each of them I got two striped dogs which I never thought I would get look there's Paige and Molly walking me um, just a bunch from just dog craft uh, in general this one even has Felix the angel the baby zombie uh, and then me with the three cats and then me from my Xbox series I actually haven't really checked on Nilla and wafer for a while uh, and Maisie so I kind of I wanted to go and see. Oh, there's Nilla. Oh, hi, Addison. Uh, there's Wafer, and I see. I saw an egg over there. So Maisie must be around here somewhere. I don't see her, but obviously she laid an egg. Unless one of the bunnies or Addison laid an egg. Look at Nilla going after that that bird bath. Goodness, Nilla. Uh, all right, so let's go ahead and actually uh, go down to the basement. I want to go and grab all of the wolves, or maybe not all of them, but a few of them to accompany me today. Um, and I also wanted to come here and grab uh, all of the gold that I have. I'm pretty sure that a couple episodes ago, uh, I took a lot of biscuits um, from uh, Madeline. And so I'm just going to go ahead and give her all of my gold, uh, honestly. Uh, hi, guys. Hello. Uh, oh, gosh. Wink, I thought that you had given birth to a pig. Uh, but that's just your stuffed animal. Um, anyway, I'm going to take one of these, actually. Uh, did they have anything in them? No, they're empty. Uh, I'm going to take this one. Oops. Uh, I didn't know my own strength with this pickaxe. Uh, there you go. And in this one, I'm going to go ahead and put down... Uh, a lot of pork chops. Let's just go and put in a bunch and then I'll keep 10 on me. Um, anyway, that's going to be for the cats, but that's for you guys. Who should come with me today? Uh, I feel like, wink, I will bring you and I will bring Basil and Tucker. That's my group for today. You guys, you can stay here and just chill. Uh, all right, let's go ahead and go up first. 
Uh, I'm going to head over, actually, and throw this cat food uh, into Tomcat Towers. Let's close the door behind me. Just so no zombies get in. Uh, hello? Oh, does the dog guard? Do you want a bath, dog guard? You can totally have a bath. There you go. Do you like water? I don't know if you really cared for water so much. Um, no? Okay, fair enough. Uh, there we go. Oh, Basil got a bath, too. Uh, all right. Let's go ahead and head on over. Actually, really quick. Let me grab my gold and give it to Madeline. Hi, Madeline. How are you? Uh, how is croissant? Hi, croissant. Uh, okay, so I owe you a lot of gold. I'm really, really sorry. I appreciate uh, you just letting me get all of those golden biscuits. I saved your life, by the way. You would have been attacked by creepers. So there you go. Uh, that's just a small amount of what I owe you. Uh, I will probably pay you back more. Um, actually, I don't know. Someone should do the math in the comments below. If you know the cost of the super treats, uh, mixed with how many I took from a previous episode, well, hmm, if you can figure that out, you might just, uh, you might just get yourself in the Dalmatian Plantation because I could not figure that out. Uh, all right, guys. I'm going to go ahead and head on up. Um, well, I, I mean, figure out how much more I owe her after I gave her, what, 27 nuggets and um, 23 bars. Hi, guys. All right. So I brought you a food bowl. So I'm going to put it. Let's move you milk toast right over here. I'm going to put it down right there. And I'm going to fill it with delicious fish for you guys. Isn't that nice? And in case you were wondering, I did finally manage to get Stampy into his cake room. Oh, Stamps, you silly, silly cat. Oh, wink. Oh, gosh. Uh, all right. Let's actually head to bed. I just remembered I have a bed right at the bottom of the, uh, the Tomcat Towers. Oh, actually, though, I want to show you guys something. <gasps> Tucker, oh, oh gosh, Basil, guys, uh, there we go, shut that, put this gate on, uh, let's go ahead and sleep first, okay, uh, guys, really, that was not very graceful, hi guys, stand guard please, you're sleeping on me, just like Paige and Molly do in real life, uh, I went ahead and finished the, uh, I finished both sides of these, uh, but I want to show you this one, actually in particular this is the litter box i'm not uh oh oh a little lag uh i'm not really sure that this was the best use of this platform because as you will see in a minute it has the most spectacular view uh oh hey guys in all of dogcraft Look at this view. You can see like this whole forest area over here. You can see a little bit of the fall area over there. The Quonset, the bark. Uh, it's pretty nice up here. So I don't know. It's, um, it's a really, really fancy toilet with a really nice view. Uh, that's all I'm going to say about it. Look at me. <laughs> oh, that's fun. Uh, all right. So in today's episode, guys... Uh, I was all set to get started on my new project. I've got a new build uh, that I'm really, really excited about. It's not a building. It's, um, well, I'll, I'll leave it a surprise for now, but I will say it's a build, but it's not a building. Uh, so that's a pretty big clue. Uh, but then in the last episode, I kind of felt bad because I, ooh, Addison, are you? Oh, Addison came. Hi, Addison. Uh, you were in the vegetable garden. You could have just helped yourself to some veg. Oh, look at Basil going crazy. Uh, all right, there you go. Oh, you don't need anything. Um, all right, so I felt a little bit bad because in the last episode, I was all excited to start my new build, and then I realized I never built a little area for the dog guard to call his own. Obviously, this isn't a good spot. This is like the little shop where you get like collars and bowls and leashes and bones and biscuits. Do I have any biscuits in there? No. 
Uh, oh, Madeline! <laughs> Madeline needs to... Uh, I can make more of those. Um, but I never gave you a bed, and I feel really bad because, like, right now it's daytime. I don't really need your services. You should be napping, but you have no place to nap. So I'm... What are you, what are you doing to Tucker? So I'm going to make you uh, your own little bedroom today, dog guard, and I'm really, really excited about uh, the little plan that I have uh, cooked up because I was trying to think okay where could it be because it has to be somewhere close to the bark um and then i was thinking well i guess i could like raise this up a level um i did some experiment i added glass blocks here which i think is really nice but i was thinking well i could raise this up a level so that he could actually get in the door and then maybe not use doors use a fence gate and put like a a bedroom right here or something but then i remembered that underneath these stairs right here that go to the second level of the bark, there is a little cubby right here. And that made me so excited. Um, I'm going to go ahead and just kind of grab uh, all of this wood out here right here. And I think that we can... Now listen, you're probably thinking, Stacy, this is crazy. It's tiny. Uh, but I think if we uh, hollow this out... I think this is gonna work uh, for the dog guard's needs. He doesn't need a lot. Um, I mean, it is rather small, but I think I think we can make this into something cozy for him. It, honestly, it's just to take little naps. So I have a, uh, I've got some supplies here. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, break all of this. Well, actually, should this be the floor or should it be one farther down? I can't remember. I guess let me do the stairs first. Uh, because the stairs will determine uh, where I place this. So if I have stairs hmm, uh, like that, then yeah, I guess this will be like the floor there. And then, oop, can you move, Wink? Wink, out of the way. Come over here. Guys, come on, sit down. Basil, darn it. Uh, okay, let me grab this. Uh, Tucker, sit. And Addison. Okay, you guys are good. Wink, you're the one that needs to move. So if I put that there and then put a stair like, um... Ah, Basil! <laughs> Come over here, please. Go to the playground or something. Go play. Uh, sit and sit. Uh, how did Wink get in... How did Wink get in there? Uh, okay, well, at least he's not bothering me. So, if I put a staircase, uh, like here, I think that that's what I wanted to do. I think. I can't remember. I don't rem uh, Wait, hold on. Maybe I should take that guy and then put it, like, there. No, 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 not like that. Uh, like... Ah! <laughs> <laughs> that was like perfect timing, Wink. I will give you that. That was hilarious, but oh so frustrating. Uh, okay, let me see if I can do this now. <laughs> that made me laugh. Uh, uh, no! No, no, no. Um, Alright, maybe if I do it from this angle. No! Do you guys know what I'm trying to do? I'm trying to get it on its like little angle. Like, like that! There we go! Oh, I like that. Um, oh, who's crying now? Oh, I'm out of a brick. Really? I'm out of a brick? Um, Tucker, you need food? I didn't think you needed food. All right, there. Sit down. Um, I think, actually, I should grab this brick uh, because I wanted to put a little... Um, I just wanted to put, like, a little thing there like that uh, because I know that iron golems like... Well, I guess I don't know if they like roses, but I know that when you kill them, uh, I think I read that you get a rose, uh, which is kind of sad. Uh, but I spotted one up here, and so I thought I would come and pluck this one for it. It was either that or an item frame with an iron ingot in it, and I thought that that was a little silly uh, for the iron. Co He's in the bath again. He's taking a shower again. What is he doing? Uh, okay, so... Let's go ahead and decorate this right there like that. And then uh, I have a torch there. This is nice. So we just have to make the bed. 
Uh, okay, so let me grab my crafting clays and I am going to make I'm really excited about this uh, I haven't made this bed ever. It's a lime green bed. I don't think no one has a lime green bed, right? No, I think basil's bed is yellow uh, Okay, so uh, green and uh, blue blue and Red 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 all right, so double bed lime right. And then, by the way, this is the deco craft mod. Oh, by the way, uh, I noticed that I have not been putting in the right descriptions in my dog craft videos as of late. Uh, and so hopefully I'll remember to in this one uh, and it will list all the mods that I use in dog craft. Uh, because I know a lot of people that are just coming and watching dog craft now, um, which hello, if you're new, hi, welcome. Uh, thank you for coming, thank you for subscribing. Um, it's confusing when this looks like such a survival world but then I've got uh, obviously some mods. So I have a list now. I'll put it back in the description of the mods. And by the way, a uh, little announcement for 2015. We are going to be adding, I think, I think two new mods at least. Um, but I know two for sure that we're going to add, uh, which I'm pretty excited about. Um, all right. You know what I should make with this extra wheat? I should make myself some bread, uh, so that I don't keep eating the dog food. Um, there we go. You know what? This is really weird. I keep getting all these achievements again that I've gotten before. And I think maybe it's because I, I had to reload the world or something. Do you know, do you guys know anything about that? I'm not really sure. Uh, all right. So let's go ahead and throw down a bed. And the reason I really like the lime is that it's actually a color um, that he has like this green it, it like really really looks good. So let's go ahead and throw down this is this the right one? There yes did it and there <gasps> Yay! Look it's done. Oh, no, it's not done I have one more thing that I wanted to add that I found in the deco craft mod um, Let me remember the recipe green and oh, that's the only green and then Blue, 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 and one red. Look at this. A keychain. It's the set of keys. These are the keys to the bark, dog guard, and I am giving them to you. This is a very, very important thing uh, that I'm going to be handing over to you. I trust you, dog guard. It's becoming night. This is when your shift begins, so sorry, you can't use your new cubby. Um... But let's go ahead and put the keys. Should I put them there or there or there? No, no bother. Let's put them here. <gasps> oh, I love it. Oh, I absolutely love this. Oh, this turned out so cute. Um, and then I guess I could put a sign up somewhere. Um, oh, I'd have one on me. So let's put it, um, let's just put it here. And it's the dog guards, what is it? The dog guards cubby? No, I've used cubby before. Um, quarters, the dog guards home, the dog guards uh, nap spot. The dog guards break room. <laughs> um, uh, hmm. Let's just put dog guard break room. <laughs> uh, is that what they call it when you have like when you change your shift like in a hospital? Do you have like um? Uh, no, what is that called? That's called something. Uh, oh well, dog guard break room. I like it. Uh, what do you think, Tucker? Let's close these doors so zombies don't go down there. It's officially night now, but in the daytime, you can go here and sleep, dog guard. Uh, but not in the nighttime. So let me grab Addison and Basil. Um, and let's go ahead and, and grab Wink, too. I don't see any meanies around. I kind of want to see the dog guard in action again, you know? Is that wrong? 
that I want to see him do his job. I don't know. Oh, I have to be careful, actually, because someone mentioned, and I think I knew this, that if a zombie came up here, I think the dog guard could jump out. Uh, and then he would just be, like, on the... Oh, look at Tomcat Towers in the night! I never saw that before! <gasps> look at this! Um, do, do iron golems attack spiders? We're gonna find out. Oh, and a zombie with gold armor! You're perfect. You are the perfect thing. Look at this dog guard! Intrusion! Intrusion in the bark! There's been an intrusion! Go, man! Go! Go! Ha <laughs> Oh, that's good! That's really, really good! Uh, anyway, I will try to deal with this spider, possibly. Do I have any arrows on me? Yes, I do. Got him! Who's growling, by the way? Are there creepers, Wink? Wink, are there creepers? Oh gosh. Wink is growling, which means there could be a creeper nearby. Oh boy. I hope not. Uh, let's get this guy right now, too. Defend the bark! Gotcha! Alright, pretty good! Uh, Alright, well, I think that's gonna do it for this episode of Dogcraft. Uh, but I hope that the dog guard likes it. And um, I was going to say in the next episode we will get uh, right to work on our build that is a build but not a building. Uh, however, if you look at YouTube tomorrow, there might just be a secret new dog craft. Uh, a little super. Do you have a pink helmet on? That's super cool. I'm gonna kill you though. Um, but I like your snazzy pink helmet. Where, where, who did that? Oh, I thought he'd drop it. Anyway, uh, that's gonna do it for today's episode of Dogcraft. But thank you so much for watching. And until next time, Paige and Molly love you. Go rescue a dog.